In this video, we'll discuss about thread cutting operation in lathe. Thread cutting is a precise operation which requires the tool to move an exact distance per revolution of the spindle. For this, a lead screw is used which acts as the master screw. There is a split nut on the carriage which can be engaged onto the lead screw so that the carriage moves as per the rotation of the lead screw. If the lead screw rotates at the same speed as the spindle, the thread generated will have the same pitch as the lead screw. If the lead screw rotates at twice the spindle speed, the pitch of the generated thread will be twice the lead screw pitch. So the pitch of the thread being cut depends on the ratio of the speeds of the lead screw and the spindle. And for different pitch to be cut, this ratio can be varied using various speed changing mechanisms including Norton gear train. The rotation of the spindle is transmitted to the input shaft of the Norton gear via a tumbler mechanism which is used to reverse the direction of rotation as required. The first stage of this mechanism gives three possible gear combinations by moving a compound gear over a spline. Thus three speed variations are possible. In the next stage there is a nine step gear which can be engaged with a gear mounted on a lever. This gear in turn transmits the power to the lead screw via another gear. In this stage, there are 9 possible speed ratios. Thus, the total Norton mechanism offers a total of 27 speed variations, which can be used to obtain different pitches of the thread being cut. The lathe generally has a table of the threads that can be cut and which combinations of the gears will give the desired pitch. So, by engaging the proper gears or clutches, we can get the required threads. In modern CNC lathes, where spindle rotation and feed are controlled electronically, threads can be cut with much ease by writing a few lines of code. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends. Any other topic you'd like to see animated like this, please comment below. Thanks for watching.